Hi Aquarius, this is Jackie Tomlin and this is your general reading. We are looking at the week of April 12th, 2021. Thank you guys for stopping by. As always, if you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. And if you're seeking a psychic reading, contact me at JackieTomlin.com or find a link to those readings below this video. Okay Aquarius, this is um, a week of taking your power back. A week of sudden changes, but it's also a week of confirmation of things that you thought you knew are coming in. Um, Libra and Pisces energy is what I'm picking up. Also some intensity and brief flirting in the love life. So this shows me intensity, whether you're single or um, a couple. But overall, a week of sudden changes. Do not get stuck on plans. So let's look. We are looking at Aquarius. This is your week of April 21st. I mean, I'm sorry, April 12th, 2021. Okay. Okay, Aquarius, we're starting with that King of Swords. This is someone with a sharp tongue. Um, someone who might beat up a lash out at you. That is a Libra type energy. And then we have the Ten of Wands. Ten of Wands shows you're overcoming your obstacles. You're pushing them to the side. You're creating a new path and a better path. And we have the Five of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles comes in with a spiritual as well as a financial blessing. With that, guys, you've got the major arcana of that death card energy. So this is a strong, powerful new beginning. But it's also letting you know that, you know, as one door closes and a new door opens, it's going to be very emotional. Center of the reading comes in with the Queen of Swords. Queen of Swords, same way, someone with a sharp tongue could also represent a Virgo. Now, guys, I've got the King and Queen of Swords here. This is indicating to me there's a power couple about to form. And we have the Seven of Wands, and I love this energy. This shows you're moving forward, and you're doing so in such a positive light. You're getting things done. You're checking things off that to-do list. Three of Pentacles, if you are worried about finances, it does show it's a timing card that it's all about timing. Three of Swords coming in. Third person's a crowd, you know, third person unwanted advice or opinions. Now I got two threes together. Two threes together here indicates delays, but know this Aquarius, any delays that occur this week are actually in your favor. And then I have the King of Pentacles. Financial stability also resonated that a Gemini may resonate with you guys. And the center of the reading bonus is the Three of Cups. Not only is this a celebration, to me it's an unexpected celebration, so it's even better. All right, Aquarius, let's continue on with this. We are still looking at your week of April 12th, 2021. And we're going to start up there at the beginning with that King of Swords. So with the King of Swords, I have the Eight of Wands. Wish fulfillment. Eight of Wands. Total happiness. Total contentment. On top of the Ten of Wands. New money. Could be a hidden treasure. Could be money that you didn't know was coming in. Right beside of that is that financial blessing. And on top of that is the Two of Wands. Travel plans. Travel by water. Death card energy comes in with the Hermit. And the Hermit says you're being pulled so many di different directions. You may have to really dig deep into your intuition and follow that lantern and know that you guys are actually on the right path, even though you might not feel like it. Center of the card with that Three of Cups comes the Ace of Swords showing the timing is now for that celebration. Seven of Wands comes in. You guys got a tower moment going on. Don't fear the tower. It is your temper. You know, it comes in like this. Very quick, very brief, very passing. But it always, it always leads you guys to something better. 
Okay? I don't see a confrontation. I just see it being your temper. Three of Pentacles comes in with the Three of Swords, which is right beside it. There's threes. Okay, first of all, third person's unadvised advice or opinion that's there twice. But also know delays are in your favor. Knight of Swords shows that this uh, three, three of Swords is going to come rushing in. What comes rushing in with it? The Seven of Wands again. That moving forward, doing so in a positive light, moving away from some negative energy is what I'm seeing here. And the Nine of Swords shows a loss of sleep. Loss of sleep is coming from... You're stuck in your head. You're ready to take control. You're not sure where to take the reins to, but you have to trust that you guys are on the right path. Overall, Aquarius, I think you're looking at a fantastic week. Um, so please enjoy. Check my website. You will find the link to On Demand for your entire love life for the month of April. Um, and the next two days I will be on live with your entire month of April coming up just in general of what you need to know. So thank you guys for watching and I will see you soon. Bye.